Uh, good morning. In the view of World Osteoporosis Day, which falls on October 20th every year, I am Dr. Ganapati here, consultant orthopedic surgeon from Chennai. First, let's know what is osteoporosis. Osteoporosis is a medical condition where the bone's structural deformity happens. Bone is a oven structure where the bones are oven in a pattern with osteoclasts or osteoblasts where the new bone formation decreases in formation of new bone. So the porosity of the bone increases which leads to structural weakness of the bone which is called as osteoporosis. Okay, who all are affected by osteoporosis? It is the females who are usually affected in osteoporosis post menopause when their hormonal demand decreases post menopause. So hence Newborn formation decreases, so the structure of the bones reduces, so the porosity of the bone increases, which may lead to frequent fractures. So, the most common people affected in osteoporosis are postmenopausal ladies or patients with some hormonal deficiency or disorders. These are the people who are commonly affected by osteoporosis. What are the symptoms usually? How can a patient know that they are going in for osteoporosis? Usually they have frequent body aches, their height decreases. Height decreases means they start stooping down, so the back bends. So that's how they say that their height is decreased. Then frequent pains in the back and a generalized weakness. These are the few symptoms of osteoporosis. In what way osteoporosis can be prevented? Osteoporosis cannot be completely cured. It can be prevented when the patient starts taking enough calcium and knows that the disease well in advance before they start getting into menopause. By adding extra calcium, regular normal diet, healthy diet with regular walking and regular exercises, osteoporosis can be to an extent prevented and it cannot be stopped. Irrespectively, every patient is going to have at least Osteopenia post menopause. Osteopenia is the early stage before osteoporosis. So, osteopenia is the structure is intermediate, means the bones are not that porous. So, early stage of osteoporosis is called as osteopenia. So, the females have to take regular calcium, have to consult doctors well in advance before menopause, start either hormonal therapy or they have to go in for regular walking and healthy diet with normal exercising and normal food. So these are the few ways which we can prevent osteoporosis. And coming to the last, what are the treatments available once the osteoporosis is there? Again there are three ways. By giving teriparatide which is an injection, a teriparatide hormone which helps in synthesis of new bone formation in directly increases the bone strength. Second is supplementing calcium intake along with Teriparatide is a mode of treatment in which calcium of 1 gram minimum per day is required in osteoporotic patients along with vitamin D supplement helps in treating osteoporosis. So in further osteoporosis can be treated when it's detected early and can be prevented when patients are guided in proper way by a proper regular consultation with an orthopedician, a gynecologist or a general physician. So let's all stay safe and uh, prevent osteoporosis and stay healthy, stay safe. Thank you.